Welcome back to the channel everybody and tonight we're going to be sleeping onto this bridge We're heading down down this side down below us here Are we going to be lucky to get straight in without a car coming past? Nope there's a car coming now. Bad timing. We'll go on back. We'll turn and come back on ourselves. We'll go to the old... Ah, uh, I believe that. Guy has just pulled, literally just pulled up there. You know what, frigate. Hang on down then. God knows how long. He'll be there. So I'm just going to him on the phone, having a chat. That's the guy. That looks like a sort of. Oh. Oh. I think he's a bit more about. He's just a, a gardener or something. This tree chipper on the back there. So this is home for tonight and I sort of thought I would just throw down some tarps there and put my little Littles tent down. Get out of the van, what's he doing? If anybody comes with a Sarah making a YouTube video, a cooking video. Let's see if he goes. That there is like a river walk. We actually just came along that. We went up over the top of the bridge and came across and down. Now, if that guy will just leave, I could talk louder to you. Let's go and check if he's still there. do is I might start cooking and if he comes over here I'll just pretend I'll use Steve and Big J's old trick just make a YouTube video a cooking YouTube video wilderness cooking because there's a good chance he'd welcome over here because um there's like a stag you can jump over there for fishermen just over there and the walk right down that river there and the fish all the way down here I'm gonna sit for a minute or two and then I'm gonna do that Nothing special. Just some noodles and some chicken grigions.
stay quiet for a while, folks. Just until it gets dark and then we know that there's nobody going to be coming down here. So there's the setup. All fearful. Let's get a little stealth cam set up. I've set up down here because that gives me a view of a whole vulnerable area, which is there where I came in. And along there where they can come down and come sneak up on me. The little stealth camp is alive. It's sitting at a bit of an angle there because I couldn't find a flat spot for it, but there we are. Glowing like a little beacon. But as I say, it looks straight up, um, straight in front to the left. That's the entrance into here. And then straight behind my tent, you come in that way as well, so we can we can see if anybody's coming there. That gives us a heads up. All still quiet out there, but still keep my voice down because there's lots of walkers go on top of that bridge and they will hear me as it echoes. But um, yeah, I'm just chilling. It is half seven. I'm gonna have a wee commish here, good old commish. And um, it didn't really bring us, like I say, much exciting snacks either. I just brought, them. I think it's gonna be fries, bag of nuts. And a pack of these kinder things have whiskey sour left and a couple more commission I was going to say um, I, I picked days off to do these videos so I've actually done my videos before this um, yesterday um, you'll have probably already seen that if, if I do it in the right order it was a uh, van life living like a van lifer for 24 hours so I came home yesterday at 7 o'clock and then packed the bag last night and then we headed off today here run a couple of errands yesterday and then said my goodbyes and went off and done this video this was actually a full bag video I was originally meant to be doing another one and I was out scouting it and I just got bad vibes from it I got bad vibes I think it's just not the right time of year for it yet or not the right you know I don't want to give that away we'll get that one done but um, yeah, well, this is this is reasonable content. No, so bread camp. Uh, I'm gonna chill here for a minute. Um, we eat some snacks. 
going to watch some more of Nightscape and then um, go out for a bit of a, a bit of a raggy to see how noticeable or how, how glowing our tint is from a distance. That's how that little tent looks in the dark. Not too bad. I think we'll be stealthy enough. The wall is covering us there. So the people down to the right can't see us on the walkway. I know in the pitch black I can't see many people walking up there, but yeah. I think we're gonna be okay. The biggest threat is straight straight behind the tent, but the camera's keeping keeping watch for us there. So, there's no point in standing in the dark here, let's get back inside. Let's try this little bad boy. Marks and Spencer's finest. I'm sure you think I'm turning the right snob going to Marks and Spencer's all the time. A lot of my food's been to Marks and Spencer's recently. But um, I just happened to be over in there that night. <laughs> Getting some cheese and wine. And I thought I'd pick these up and try them. This is a... This is a whiskey sour, lemon juice with two measures of blended whiskey. Doesn't say what sort of whiskey. Just blended malt Scotch whiskey. I'll do the job. Same Wilson's new video out here, so I'm going to watch that. This is a Bobby USA edition, and I'm going to be playing this game in real life. Scumpy fries. Yes, please. Cheers. joke of the day. Did you hear about the kidnapping in the woods? It's okay. He woke up. There's a cat hanging around that's very interested in my um, infrared camera. I think I maybe caught a tiny bit of it on the camera, but right. Um, as you've seen, it's just after half one. I'm gonna get to sleep and I'll 
see you. Five o'clock in the morning. See you tomorrow. It's that time again, folks. Pack up time. No check the alarm clock this morning. We have to be stealthy. Sounds miserable out there. Right, let's get this camp pulled down. That's where we stayed last night, dude, below there. Got all that one done. And in the bag. Early start once again, yes. But for a change, it's not me going to work. It's the missus. I have to go home and get her get away to work, so. I'm on the school runs today. But anyway. Up under a bridge, ticked off the list. Thanks for watching this far, and um, see you in the next one. Keep your stealth.